He said... What did you do? I... Hero, you have caused confusion and delay and terrible trouble to my trousers. Stupid bird. Smudger just laughed. <laughs> yeah, boo snubs. What do you think of this, Thomas? Thomas took no notice. But Emily didn't say thank you to Trevor. All she said was, about time. Oh, no. Gravel! Oh. The mud sprayed all over Reneus and Scar Lowy. <gasps> Help! His firebox was on fire. Tit for tat. Tit for tat. <laughs> I like children, he whispers happily. <laughs> Fiery Flynn fudges it! His driver and fireman inspected him. Something's broken inside you, Gordon, said his fireman. I never sleep, I'm too busy working. That's too busy. Hey, Chuck. <gasps> this went on and on till the diesel's eyes nearly popped out. Stop, you're making me giddy. The two engines gazed at him. I just wondered if you had any spare puff. Spare puff? Oh, they're coming for us. How wonderful. We're safe. Oh. That's right. I'm tired of taking a back seat to a bunch of steam trains. I can fucking fly. Oh, groaned Gordon. Get out of my way. You are a steam Tram. Steam trams can't be rescue engines. Toby blinked. Thomas was cross. That's nice. We don't need to stop, said Thomas happily. Yes, we do. He has lost his voice. Percy was worried. I hope he finds it soon. Plunging into the gap, shrieking like a lost soul. Percy, what are you talking about? <laughs> Just look what you've done to our breakfast. Now I shall have to cook some more. She banged the door. The snowbank and buffers will stop him, said a workman. But he was wrong. His driver showed him what he looked like in a mirror. Then he saw his friend, Mrs. Kindly. She looks miserable. Ooh, how lovely. Thanks for the reminder, Aeneas. And... <coughs> wailed Mavis. She began to shudder violently. Nonsense, said her driver. Come on now, back down. Daisy lurched backwards. It's a pleasure to... <gasps> oh. Is there a problem, Mr. Oliver? Yes! What? Hmm, said Daisy. Keep your old bullseye. And she scuttled to her shed. 